Martin Exteriors roof cam in Roscoe at 251 and Elevator Road. Cloudy skies, not much in the way of winds. Rain coming later this afternoon and uh, yeah, maybe an embedded thunderstorm or two. Hopefully not a lot of rain. Our rivers are I pretty know. darn full yeah. it's in our farm fields are still wet. <laughs> a little flooded. Yeah, yeah, we farmers need to get out there here yeah. pretty quick. That's for sure. Chenier Barmore joins us. We will be drying out this weekend. And there's plenty to do this weekend, and the weather's certainly going to cooperate. Oh, we got some 70s in the forecast. Yeah, and uh, <laughs> a little return to the 70s. We'll get to that in a moment. First, let's go back to the 1990s, 1990s here. Yeah. Uh, tomorrow night, uh, Broadway at the Coronado coming back to yeah, town. Everybody knows this classic 90s rom-com for the, for the movie, but Pretty Woman the Muti Musical is here in Rockford this uh, tomorrow night at the Coronado, and it is based on one of Hollywood's most be beloved uh, romantic films. The Not Julia, Julia, Julia Roberts, Roberts, Richard Gere. Richard Gere yeah. <laughs> the 1990 romantic comedy is loosely based on My Fair Lady. Right, yeah. The musical is two acts and features several original songs. This show features an original score by Grammy winner Brian Adams mm. and Jim Valance and was produced by original director Gary Marshall. It premiered on Broadway in 2018, and Rockford is, of course, a part of the U.S. tour this year. A limited supply of tickets are still available, so make sure to get those now, and ticket prices will range from around $35 to $80, and the show begins at 8 p.m. tomorrow, tomorrow night, night yeah. at the Coronado PAC. That's right, and if you have not seen, the Broadway at the Coronado has been coming to the Coronado yeah. with three or four shows for yeah. several years now. Yep. If you haven't seen those, they're really top notch. They really, really are. Yeah. High quality productions mm -hmm. and, yeah. and very great shows at the yeah. Coronado. All right, now let's go back to the 70s. We're going to go back, toss them back <laughs> to the 70s. Now. We'll be in the 70s <laughs> with our temperatures, and we're going back to the Vegas 70s, yeah. huh? Some Las Vegas favorites, some 70s Vegas favorites from Elvis and Tom by local celebrity Denny Diamond over at the Spring, Tree, Uni Spring Creek United Church of Christ oh, okay. with concerts on the creek. Uh, Denny Diamond returns to the stage to grace it with his new concert, Elvis and Tom celebrating the Las Vegas years of legendary performers Elvis Presley and Tom Jones. Oh, okay. Doors will open. I was wondering who that Elvis was. Right, I, right. I knew I Tom Jones. We knew Tom, right but yeah. who's Elvis? Yeah. <laughs> Doors will open at 2, pay, 2 p.m. and the matinee will run from 3 to 5 p.m. Snacks and soft drinks will be available before the concert and during the intermission for purchase. There is no admission charge, but donations are, of course, appreciated to continue to keep these concerts on the creek going. Attendance is limited to 150, so it's best to arrive early to guarantee seating. And it's going to be a beautiful Saturday to yeah. sit out and enjoy some 70s classic from Elvis Presley and Tom Jones. At Spring Creek uh, United uh, Spring Creek Church. Yep, uh, United Church of Christ. Yeah, Church of Christ. Okay, and that'll be from, uh, yeah, 2 o'clock is when the, the, gate, the doors open mm -hmm. there. The yes. All right, and uh, that, that we got one Friday, we got one Saturday. Saturday. You got to have one Sunday. Let's have one. So let's let's see what's going Sunday. on Sunday. Sunday, you know, Mac Town Lincoln History and Rockin has these Sundays at Mac Town, and this Sunday they're doing Atto Atto or a spear th uh, spear throwing demonstration. Adalati. Adalati. Yeah, Adalatl. 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 Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Uh, spear throwing, huh? Yeah, features some educational experiences for all this week's program. Um, the what is an atolotl? It's like an, an ancient weapon used uh, thousands of years ago for spear throwing. It's like the lever that you use to, to throw spears in the ancient days. Oh, okay. Visitors can learn about the atol atol and other historic life skills of the past. Adults can try chopping wood with a stone axe or testing out an atol atol, while kids can help grind corn and even take some corn home to make some delicious corn cakes. During the Kids can't throw the atol atol? No, 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 no. That's not going to be any of no, that. No, no. All right. <laughs> Oh, come on. It would be good family fun. It, it, it would be. <laughs> what else? Uh, they, and there, of course, the, they have restored a number of uh, buildings there yeah. on, the, on the grounds. They there. have restored a number of buildings, and those buildings will be open to explore from 1 to 3 p.m. during the event. And that is this Sunday at the Mactown Forest right. Preserve. Golf course to the left, right. the living history to the, right. to the right. <laughs> and, uh, and uh, yeah, you can uh, and learn how to throw and maneuver and add a lot. Learn about add a lot. Yeah. yeah. Spear throwing. Okay. <laughs> I, I guess those probably came in handy back in the right, day. Right, right, right. <laughs> All right. I noticed uh, GoRockford.com was, uh, was a place to go for information on, on that event mm -hmm. and uh, also the, the concert, uh, Concerts in the Creek. Mm -hmm. I mean, that, that just ha must have everything you could ever imagine, everything doesn't it? Everything and plenty more. And, uh, everything and more. And more. <laughs> How can there be room for more if there's <laughs> already got everything? Right. Go find it at GoRockford.com. Thank you, Shanir. Thank you. We'll be right back.